Everybody, welcome back to another video of Missy and Akeem. My name is Missy and today's video is actually going to be somewhat of a haul and then at the same time be uh, me creating a spa serene feel bathroom. One thing that I talked about is how I was really like big on having a relaxing spa like space in the bathroom and so the beginning of the video is actually going to be a haul and then towards the end of the video is actually going to be me decorating the bathroom. I did film the haul more than a few weeks ago, actually. And then I have filmed the decorating part a little later. So if you are interested in seeing the decorating part, I will link where it starts at below. And then if you want to go ahead and watch the whole video, go ahead and start now. I want to thank you guys for checking it out. And if you haven't already, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. That way I know if you guys like these videos. If you have any suggestions or different things, just please feel free to leave them below. And um, stick around, all right? Target has this line. And it is the Casa Luna bedding. I'm in love with it. Most of the stuff is going to be from the Casa Luna Target brand. I did go a little crazy, but I'm okay with that. I'm going to talk about some things that I got from Target, Home Goods, and um, Amazon were like the three main places that I shopped at. Like I said, starting with the floor runners. I got two floor rugs. Is this a fabric? This might be the runner. This is the Casa Luna floor runner and this will go between here and here but it's super plush very comfortable all white i went with all white towels and bathroom linen because it's just easy to pop it into the uh wash machine all together bleach oxyclean whatever you choose to use gain the whole nine and then i just got two of these And these, like I mentioned, are the bath rugs, the plush bath rugs. I got a ton of towels, okay? I got two packs of the Casa Luna waffle towels. Um, after getting those, I came across the organic bath towels by Casa Luna. And in these, they were um, like more of a cotton feel versus the waffle. And these were four hand towels, four washcloths, and four bath towels. So then I went this route. And so this is the hand towel. And super soft, feels amazing. So, and then um, in addition to that, then I came across the bath sheets. And I got the bath sheets because Akeem is 6'1. And I felt like, you know, maybe he wanted something a little bit more. Let me see if I can show the height on these. So these are the bath sheets. And these are the Casa Luna cotton modal bath sheets. And as you can see, wherever it pops in at. It's about to be so ghetto. These are super um, ultra absorbent. So I got these as well. And I got two bath sheets. With the bath sheets, I originally ordered the organic blend, but then they sent me the modal by accident. And y'all, these feel absolutely amazing, guys on it these feel absolutely amazing i mean they are super soft they feel so luxurious so i definitely wanted to get another one of these so i did but then i still have one more organic so i'm like i don't know if i want to buy another organic one or if i want to go ahead and take that back but we'll see so, so i did get these scottish fine soaps these are sea kelp these as well this is the hand lotion and then i got the cream hand soap uh -oh. not gonna show that has a glare so i do have these as well um i got this pillow the spa pillow off of amazon here are the sections and then it just goes like this and then i'm sorry this way that's for your neck for your head and then it has a hook so you can hang it up other small items i got i got a couple of these um brushes i got these from home goods they were 3.99 and 4.99 so i got two of those <laughs> around my um tub i keep a lot of jars a lot of glass jars apothecary jars and different things like that and i'll keep bath salts in them i keep soaps in them um 
a little bit of everything actually um i have little things that i usually keep body oils and stuff like that so it's just easily grabbable and then it just looks good around the toe i ended up getting some bath bombs some dr teal's bath bombs from target these are usually about three or four ninety nine so I got the lavender essential oil. Let me put them over here. And then I have the um, ultra. I'm sorry, the eucalyptus and spearmint as well. Also got this um, the bo foaming bow bath. This is also lavender. I got these from Home Goods for three ninety nine. So I got this exfoliating back scrubber. It's a two-sided back scrubber. And I got this off of Amazon. I think it was like $11 or $12. So I am a sucker for candles and smell goods. So this, oh man, this smells so good. So this is Fireside Embers. And I don't think it says what it smells like exactly. But um, I got this for $6.99 at Home Goods. And I actually got two of these and it just gives like this super smoky <sighs> woodsy smell. And I love that from time to time. So I got two of those and that's also, that's made by DW Home. I also, oh God, this smells so good. I also have this morning mist, super cute rainbow um, top. And this smells super amazing. So I got two of these. I have two of these, which are the sweet apple crisp um, and I'm sorry, the sweet apple. It says crisp and soft wooden stick wick candle from DW Home. Also, these man candles smell amazing. And I also got another DW. I, I didn't realize, I don't even think I'm obsessed with DW Home. I just, I go on Home Goods, I see what I like, what draws my nose to it, what I think will burn well, and I just buy it. It just so happens that most of them are DW Home. This one I have burned. This is Apple Blossom. It's sweet and floral. And I burned this once when I took uh, my bath, um, my first bath in the house, and I absolutely love it. The other thing that I have is going to be my um, tray, which I'll do like more of a close-up on that when I do the bathroom. I got that for Christmas. I got that for Christmas from McKean, um, for specifically for the new house. Um, and that's it. Stay tuned and let's see how we decorate this bathroom. All right. So starting off, I did return a pack of the waffle knit towels and I kept a pack just for the specific reason to keep behind the tub. Um, I felt like these would look great on the towel rack. I feel like waffle knit equals spa. You think of waffle knit robes, you think of luxury. So I definitely wanted to keep these behind the tub for a more luxurious feel. These candles I got from Home Goods last summer, so I forget the cost of them. I believe they were $6.99, and um, I got two different sizes. The two top ones are non scented, but the bottom ones are, and they smell amazing. And I'm just trying to figure out how I want to configure them. That way, I'm not causing a fire hazard when I do decide to burn them. And then the apothecary jars, I have a ton of these. I've collected so many of them over the years. I've sold some because I've had too many. And I've gotten those pretty much from like Home Goods, from um, Michaels, and from some of the thrift stores. Most of my candles and candle holders have come from Home Goods. The ones in the back we got around 2014, I believe. Um, so I'm not sure if they still sell them, but they're great holders. I actually pulled them off of the tub and put them in the shower, but I most likely moved them again. I showed you guys before when I had picked up a box of the Sea Kelp soaps, and this is just me getting a second box. I do have purple and I believe orange, but I wanted to have another set of white just to kind of go with the bathroom feel. 
In the other jars, I have bath salts by Dr. Teal's as well as the bath bombs. And I um, absolutely love Dr. Teal's brand, it's amazing. Here I'm just refilling the oil jar that I purchased and uh, just really ch changing out the packaging just for the uh, look of the spa for the bathroom. These scrubbers I got from Amazon, four in a pack, and I think it was about $8. I'm not exactly sure, but I'll make sure I link it below. This tray is the tray that I was telling you guys that I got for Christmas, and it allows you to place your wine, your favorite book or tablet, soap, your favorite candle on, and it's just great for going over the tub, and I'm sure you guys have seen them everywhere. I got mine off of Amazon. Actually, Akeem got it for me, and I will also link that link below. broke the top to it um, after filming so you will see that the jar is missing a lid I do have extra lids just from collecting them over the years I just have not had a chance to get in the garage to replace it this towel we actually got for a housewarming gift and I believe it's a Turkish collection and it feels amazing super amazing super plush uh, thick it just is it's, it's amazing So I did not show these at the beginning of the, of the uh, haul, but if you watched our Home Goods haul, you did see these trays. Uh, most of everything in here I got from Home Goods. The spoons I got from Amazon, and the diffuser I got from Target, and that's also the Casa Luna brand. I absolutely love this tray um, and the setup. I actually only added it because Akeem complained that there was just so much white in the bathroom. So I felt like this uh, sea green would be great um, touch. I feel like it's still nice and serene. It's not too much of a harsh color and I actually like it a lot. And so with that, I just went ahead and picked up other items that I felt like would be in the same color family just to keep inside the tray. The Tranquility Bathroom Spray is also from Target. And I got this jar from Home Goods years ago, like years and years ago. So I like to keep my um, little items in here, little face cleaning essentials. And I actually showed you guys this uh, video and a photo um, a couple of weeks back and everyone told me that they love the setup and I agree, I absolutely love the setup. Um, I may or may not change it out because I'm very uh, indecisive, but as of right now, I love the way it looks in the bathroom. I love how it brings in the pop of color and it's still super relaxing and it just smells super amazing over here. And here is the finished product. This is, you know, I don't know you guys. Like, I, tell me what y'all think. Are y'all feeling it? Does it look amazing to y'all? Does it make you feel amazing? Because I absolutely love, love, love the space. I love the shower. Once I get in there, I'll show that more. But this is my relaxing space. Akeem went ahead and hung up the tray for me that I got from Home Goods. And y'all, tell me what y'all think. 
are y'all feeling it? Are y'all not feeling it? Like, be real. So again, we still have a lot to do in the bathroom, but as of right now, this is the space that we've been dealing with. I'm lost for words. It's so relaxing. Like, I want a bath now. Alright guys, so thanks for sticking to the end of the video. I hope you all liked it. I hope you enjoyed how relaxing it looks. Um, I hope you were inspired. If you have any suggestions for me, moving things around, I'm always up for suggestions. If you made it to the end of the video, make sure you comment relaxing so I know that you made it. It is very relaxing during the day, but I do love it at night when it's you know dim and it's dark and it's right before bed with some music going. But as you can see, in the daytime, it is just as relaxing. So again, I hope you guys enjoyed it. Make sure you are thumbs upping these videos so we know what you guys like. So we're making sure we're creating that content for you. And um, stay tuned for the next video, all right?